All right, guys, so we got spared by the storm here in the Tampa Bay area. We didn't really get as much direct hit as we thought we were gonna have, but we definitely uh, did get some damage down here. And uh, we worked right through the storm here, so we knew it wasn't gonna hit us, and we kept on working. But uh, the uh, Southerner counties definitely got hit hard, so we gotta definitely keep them in our prayers, those people out there, and make sure that they're uh, safe. So they'll know more you know, to come of how much damage it did down there. But I had a little bit of an incident here when I came in this morning. We had uh, one of the stacks must have got tweaked up on the roof and we had some leakage in the booth. So one of my jobs now I got to fix and I'll show you that. So let's go check that out. All right, so these are the ones I shot last night before I left here. I came in and uh, did these two jobs and I pushed this bumper over after I was done clearing and we had some water damage come in. It looks like it's coming in from the stack and uh, could have tweaked it up there. So we're gonna get up there and look at it, but that's definitely not uh, you know, a big deal for what we could have had to deal with down here. So we're, we're lucky that we had just a small incident and uh, we were able to just keep on rolling. So we're gonna keep on rolling. We'll clean up the shop, get things pushed out and then uh, keep doing what we do. So. Just wanted to show you guys this one here because in the body shop, it's never a dull moment. There's always something that happens and uh, now we just got to push through it and get it done. But the sad thing is, is I had this bumper when I was clearing this over here and after I got done with it, I said, hey, I'm already cleared, let me move it. And I pushed it right here. And when I pushed it right there, that's where it leaked on it. So nothing else got ruined these jobs came out nice and uh, that was the only part that got screwed up so we're kind of lucky with that and we can't complain so just wanted to show you that little update on what happened here and uh, we're going to keep on rolling so let's shoot one of these jobs that we got today and uh, see if we have any problem once we turn the booth on with this uh, stack up here because these are the uh, intake and exhaust stacks we have located up here in the top and I think we might have a leak from the roof that that stack might've got tweaked. So let's uh, see what happens. And we did have some water come in on the top of the booth. So we might've had an issue with the uh, stack up there. So we got up here and checked and uh, we're gonna have to fix that too. That way we don't have any more water coming in. So we're gonna turn this on now and then uh, it'll probably dry out cause it wasn't much of a uh, leak. So, but we definitely got to get that addressed. All right, so we're gonna knock this down and see how coarse we have to get. Hopefully we can just smooth it down with like a 600 and uh, base it and clear it. But it looks pretty, uh, pretty damaged from that water. So we're gonna buzz this down, reshoot this, and then shoot this with another load of parts. That way we uh, can knock this thing out with the same clear from a different job. So we'll let's see what we need to do to uh, buzz this and smooth it down. All right, so this is the load. We got two doors for a black Tesla. We're gonna panel paint those. A lower spoiler we have for another vehicle. Then that bumper we had the water damage on. We got it all sanded out nice. And we're gonna go ahead and paint this one and get this finished up here along with a BMW bumper we've got. So we got this load loaded up. I'm gonna shoot it and I'll show it to you guys finish up.
All right, guys, so you've seen that stuff came out nice and that bumper, we went ahead and uh, 400 it down. I went from six to four and then I went ahead and sealed it and that thing came out nice. So we did that load. Those Tesla doors came out clean and uh, I'm really, really enjoying this clear. I'm starting to lay it down really nice and it's coming out clean. I uh, changed the filters and uh, cleaned the booth up yesterday and we're really getting some nice clean jobs out of this place. So I hope everybody made it out safe and uh, we'll see you on the next one.